Hey guys, welcome back to my channel for part number 36 of Let's Play These Sims for Get to Work. And we are back with Aaron and Sarah at the little arcade where they went ahead and started hanging out, trying to get to know each other a little bit more after he gained the guts to actually really go ahead and ask her out to hang out, really, because... Again, they do go to school together. She is the new girl in town, and she's actually on the varsity cheerleading team, so it's kind of nerve-wracking for the weirdo, like, kid who just really doesn't really do much except for program at home and hack people and all that kind of stuff. So it's very awkward for him to go up and talk to people like this. So it's starting out pretty good. They actually are very good. She's actually really into him. She's definitely flirty as well. So we're going to try to get him to be a little bit flirty as well. So we're going to flirt... They do have an interest in each other, obviously, since she is liking it. And he does want to become flirty as well. So, and they're getting along pretty well. She's definitely taking to the compliments and whatnot. So we'll be a little bit romantic and compliment her appearance. And then if we can get him to be flirty, that would be awesome. We'll do a pickup line. Okay, so they're actually getting a little bit more romantic. Let's go ahead and reveal our crush to her. Okay, so he's being flirty. He's being flirty. Let's go ahead and reveal our crush and see how she feels about that. Let's see if she's into it still. Ooh, wow. Why are you complaining? What do you... No, don't complain about your parents. It's not... That's not sexy. That is not sexy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Be sexy. Mm-hmm. That's how you do it, Aaron. That is not... That's not being sexy. It's complaining about your parents. Come on. I want you to reveal your crush to her. That's what I want you to do. So romantic. More. Is it not on here anymore? Okay. I guess it's not going to. We aren't going to seduce. I don't think he's able to really pull that off. But we'll be a little bit more flirty. And um, do a little sexy pose. I mean, I know you're not the best at being sexy, Erin, but... Yeah, show off the muscles. You've been working out lately. She likes jocks. She likes that kind of guys. But again, she is also very sensitive for the nerdy kids as well. But maybe we can have them work on homework together. It is Saturday. I know it's not what you want to do. But um, maybe she doesn't have homework because she was just added. So I don't think she has actually homework for her to be able to work on. So I guess they can't work on it together. But maybe they can go ahead and have like a nice little... Food. I think he's going to, oh, he's not really that hungry, but maybe we can have them come over here and enjoy like a little lunch together. Why not? It's about 12 p.m. So I think if we can um, come over here with her, maybe we can go ahead and hang out over here. We don't have to be at the bar the whole time. So what if we have them come over here together and just grab something to eat real quick? I know we could grab stuff at the bar, but I don't think that'd be very appropriate for teenagers being at the bar. I mean, it is 12 p.m., so it's not really they're serving alcoholic drinks right now, but I just think it'd be a little bit awkward. I think he wants to impress her a little bit more, just showing off all these different kinds of things. Let's go ahead and grill up some veggie burgers, because I'm pretty sure she likes to eat a little bit more healthier, so I'm pretty sure not a lot of her um, desires would be, like, regular hot dogs or, like, beefy little burgers so i think she would prefer the vegan burger as well or veggie burger where are you going we're cooking for you where are you going sarah you don't have to watch tv the whole time you are a cheerleader you can enjoy the outside world sometimes in your life gosh dang rude and there's a trolley mr rogers where are you at boy okay so he's almost out the burgers um I guess Sarah's done talking to us. Okay, she's going back inside. Oh, well, if she wants to come back out, that's fine. If she wants to go home, that's fine as well. We're going to go ahead and eat up our veggie burgers then because, you know what? We made them. We're going to enjoy them. So he's going to go ahead and grab himself a serving as well. What's Devin doing at work? He's not doing too bad. He has to solve some more cases. But I think Devin is kind of done with the detective career. I think he's pretty much ran the course of it it's a little stressful he definitely enjoys more being at home than being at work so he, i think he may when he gets home from work go ahead and just basically call it quits on his job because i think he's ready to move on and just start a whole new project in his life 
what does he want to do? He wants to be rich, but he's not really making that much money off of this. He's only making 100 Oh, he's actually making $100 an hour. It's not too bad. Okay, we'll go ahead and... We'll play one more day on him, see if he's still glitched up. If he is still glitched up, then I think he may go ahead and make the executive decision to go ahead and quit and maybe start up in a different kind of career. And are you getting sick? You are feverish. Aaron is hot, like super hot. Not that good. Uh, ready for his close-up kind of way. Oh, poor baby. I think it's all that flirting he went on that's just kind of like getting a rush to his head, so... Hopefully, that'll help him out a little bit more. But I don't think he can throw anything away. I think it'll just disappear. And this girl. Let's go talk to this girl. Uh, we need to make some friends. So this is actually a Westbrook, I think. One of the other families. Yes, Ingrid Westbrook. Let's go ahead and try to be friendly with her. She was saying hi. She's like, yeah, let's go or not. Nope. Okay, she's leaving. I thought she was leaving, but I guess she's going to come talk to us, I think. Oh, no, we're going to come to her. Okay, we're just going to be friendly. Uh, we're going to discuss our interests, kind of like just get to know her as well, because she is new as well. They did move in around the same time, uh, but he actually has not been to school with her at all. So this is a completely new girl, and they're actually neighbors. Wow. I forget that they live in our neighborhood, which is actually pretty cool, but... And that's just her mom, I think, too. Yes, it is. See, I'm already recognizing these sims like crazy, and I just moved them in. But he has to go to the... Oh, her mom's joining in. Okay. But he has to go to the bathroom, so maybe we'll have him come back over here real quick. If I can find the bar right over here. Okay. So is Sarah still here, or did she go home? I think she went home. So what we're going to go ahead and do... Let's probably send Aaron back home so he can go to the restroom and then we can play with Lily a little bit more as well. So let's go ahead, send him back home, get him some medication so he can start feeling better because I really don't want him being sick right now. So we're gonna have to work on that a little bit, but hopefully he'll feel better with a little bit of dosage of Medisonio. Okay, so we are back home. He definitely has to go to the bathroom, so we're gonna send him not in there because that bathroom is all kinds of broken. We're going to send him upstairs, use the bathroom. And what is what is Miss Pregnant Girl Lily doing up in here? Looks like she's going to clean out the bad food, which is great. I guess she's just cleaning up a little bit before Devin gets home because all of this stuff's all over the place. We need a new toilet, either replace it or fix it. Um, Let's go ahead and clean it. Can we do that? Well, it's broken i guess so so she's gonna clean the toilet do a little bit of house cleaning he is not feeling good so oh my god what am i doing right now i'm like clicking off the screen and everything um okay sorry if the audio cut out in this or not i really don't know what's going on i kept clicking off the screen because i have it in like a windowed full screen mode right now just to make it a little bit easier for recording and testing stuff out so i hope it kind of doesn't ruin it right now so he's going to go ahead and order up some medicine if he wants to. Um, purchase medicine. Excuse me. We'll just buy the one. And then he can take that to start feeling better. And then probably we'll go ahead and try buying a Sims lottery ticket just to see if we can win some money. I haven't had any luck with it yet. I think I won like a $300 total in my game at all times. So hopefully... We can get something good from it. And then when he's done with that, we'll go ahead and, uh, you know, do some programming, work on that skill a little bit. So we need to pick 1 through 20. So we're going to do 18. We have to do 6. 4, 2, 13, 7, and 15. We'll be those numbers. Let's see what we get. And we only got two out of six. So we are not going to be focusing on that anymore. So he's going to go into programming. Um, does he want to like program something crazy or whatnot? Like what's in here? Play video games for five hours. So why don't we have you start working on that and you can play some Sims Forever. 
why not? That's like the best game in the world. So we'll have him try that out. Are you hungry again? Really? Oh my God, Lily. I guess this pregnancy is really getting up into you. She's like, yeah, I'm hungry. I'm getting bigger. I need to have some food in this belly. Get this baby growing good. Hopefully we only have one kid and not um, twins or anything. Because I would literally die. I had a heart attack when I had triplets in the art majors. I don't need to have any more kids now. Oh, we can just deal with one and be happy with it. So when she's done with this. We're going to have her. We're not going to repair anything. Uh, because One, because she's pregnant. And two... Devin has a higher repair skill, so he's going to be working on that. So she'll have to come upstairs to use this. And then she needs to acquire level six of the logic skill. What is she at right now? She's at level four, almost five. So I don't know what else we could do besides this, really, to gain that skill. But I kind of want to have her transform stuff. And, like, work on her... And what I found out, actually, when I did uh, do, like, the whole um, thing with the uh, cloning the serums, the one that I had it was actually tainted. So when we went ahead and tried doing... Oh, we got a lot of stuff we can sell in here. But I was actually looking for this right here. Um, but when we were doing these serums, it uh, actually... Um, What's it called? I can't think of the word. Um, it was tainted, so it didn't get the full price from it. So what I'm going to have her do, actually, just because I love all this stuff, I may keep Devin in the police career. Just because of all this stuff. I'm not really sure or positive what I will be doing, but I'm pretty sure that'll be fine. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to transform this room, Aaron's room, into the um Aaron's room into uh, an office and then we're going to transform this room into a um god I cannot think right now a uh his room so we're just going to change all of this stuff up we'll keep all the bed stuff the same change up that looks good Perfect. So he can move into this room. We'll make the nursery in here. And then for right now, we're going to make this our study. So we're going to sell all of this ish. Okay. And then we're going to buy or actually take this out of our inventory and make it into like a little lab slash detective room, trying to focus on like the stuff that we get for our careers. So we're going to have her come in here and actually make some serums what do we have the ghost goo i think is our current big one or is it the slimify i think it's actually slimify so if we have her use the computer to purchase some seeds um what do we actually need for it the synthesized serum actually actually made some good money too i don't know how i feel about his thing okay so for slimify it's Parsley and carrots. Is that the one we had now? Don't do anything. Is that the one we have now? Slimify. That's tainted. So it's only 400. Let's go ahead and try making the ghost goo then. Since she's up here. We have mushrooms. So she's going to come in here and actually experiment this. Try to build up that skill before she goes to work. So she can start working on some other things as well. At the, um, at the, uh, you know, uh, Science lab. Who, why are you here? Who are, we don't know you. No one knows you. Who are you? Who are you? We don't know you. We know your younger sister, but why are you here, Scarlet? I have a feeling she's here for Aaron. So I think we're going to have him stop playing his game for right now and come downstairs to see what Scarlet wants. I don't know what she wants. Let's go ahead and do a friendly introduction to Scarlet. See what she needs. Oh, we're coming down to talk to you. You came to our door. We're going to talk to you. Sorry, girl. You're not going anywhere. Okay, so she's working on that. He's repairing. And then we're just going to have him talk to her real quick. 
Okay, Scarlett. Um, yes, I know you're um her older sister, but what is what is this? I feel I have a feeling she noticed us with her sister, or Ingrid actually probably mentioned us to Scarlett since they are sisters, probably really close. So um, I think she went ahead and just uh um went ahead and let her sister know about the new the, their neighbor Aaron actually met her at the park and he was very nice to her, very kind. And definitely, definitely had a kind of liking to him. So I think Scarlett's basically over here just trying to see what our family's all about, making sure that Aaron is a good kid and not really, um, not really trying to just like mess with her sister. I think she's very protective over her and whatnot. So I think she's just basically trying to check out who Aaron is and whatnot. So it looks like Lily actually created the serum. So I think they can sit and talk. I think that's all Scar that really wanted to come over here and talk to us about, which is actually pretty nice. I would like to see what their family dynamic is kind of like at their house as well. So that's actually pretty nice of her to come over and see. So we made the ghostly goo, which is actually, actually, now we got it. Actually, we're 600. So it's basically a better one than the other one we had i think it's better than the slimify so what we're gonna do is just definitely throw this in here because it's our new lab um and we're going oh we have a bunch of stuff we can have already i don't need to order stuff great i'm like learning all these things right now so what we're gonna have her do is actually start cloning all of this goo we're gonna sell the slimify is worth 500 but when we mutate it or clone it it's really only worth like probably half the price maybe maybe not even that i'm not really sure so so far so good we're cloning up this goo which is awesome we learned that scarlet is unemployed which is it's i it's fine i guess it's not really a big deal so we got one ghost goose so we're just gonna have her come up here and clone as many of these as possible until we actually get a dud. So, so far, so good. She's thinking about the baby, which is fine. They're probably doing really good right now. But I don't really know what this does. Drink the serum to temporarily turn your sim into a ghost. That would actually be a great prank to play at work one day. So maybe we'll go ahead and have her save an extra one. We're going to have one to clone... And then one extra one for like something else to have. So like pranks or whatnot at work. So, okay. So that one's actually bad. So we're not going to work this. But these are actually cool. I don't know what they're actually for. A basic building block of inner element molded into a development. So I don't, I don't really know. They're basically are worth nothing, I think. So we're going to put this back into actually leave that there. We're going to sell four of these potions because we do want to have two on us at all times. Okay, there we go. We gained $2,400, which is awesome. That, I think that's like the best part of these serum things is having the actual, um, you know, I can't, I'm like, I don't get what it is. I'm like losing my train of thought all throughout this video, which is kind of sad. But, um, Oh, it was actually on. Okay, we can leave it on. Um, but yeah. You guys know what I meant. It's definitely cool. It's one of those um, fun extra little things that come with the, you know. God, I, I should just stop talking. Let's forget about it, y'all. Let's just move on. Continue with our lives, you know. Just act like nothing's happened and whatnot. But um, I want to have her um, actually experiment with this a little bit. I don't know what it does. I have a feeling it helps with your logic skill, maybe? Please don't blow up the house right now. I don't know. Does it help with the logic? I feel like it would, wouldn't it? No, we're still at 93%. I really don't know what it's for. I'm not really positive. But we have... Oh! Hey, Scarlet. You seem very upset. Why are you here still? Aaron is done talking to you. Why are you here? He's doing push-ups. Aaron, what are you doing? You're just standing outside, not really doing anything. So why don't you go back to play some more video games? We only have one hour left before you complete this uh, 
thing. So let's go ahead and play a game. And I'm sorry for keep saying go ahead. I used I got a comment back in the day. Um probably probably a year ago from now. That was like uh they probably are still subscribed to my channel too. Uh, they're like, how come you keep saying go ahead with every thing you do which is basically i don't know what it is it's just like uh yeah well we're going to go ahead and like just change the subject i don't i don't know what it what it is but i tried to stay away from it for a while and actually did pretty good of it so i, I i'm i'm falling back into it and i caught it in a few videos of mine so it's kind of like bothering me now so we actually have two of our things done already we have three thousand dollars in electronics which is obvious and then we have level three of the programming skill which i currently think is what his current level is right now um program yeah he is only level three so it looks like we only have to maintain focus for two straight hours god god only knows how that'll happen but we're gonna have him stop doing this and work on his homework a little bit for next week and then Devin. What do you have to do for work? You just have to solve some cases, which you're actually pretty tired. You don't have to work tomorrow, which is great. So why don't you clean up your plate from earlier? And then let's ask, um, let's do a cheerful introduction. Let's get to know this girl. We don't know why she's here. Uh, she was talking to Aaron, but, um, but he doesn't really know why. Why is this older lady coming to talk to my son? Like, this is my pride and joy right now. Why are you talking to my son? But she's explaining, we're actually neighbors. We just moved into town. Your, my uh, younger sister actually became friends with your son. And they actually go to the same school together. So it turns out that they were he was just greeting her to the neighborhood and greeting her to the town in general and school and whatnot. So just really scoping out the area. Scarlet's romantic. That's great. That's awesome. Now, I think it's really time for you to leave. Sorry, but... I have stuff to do. My kid has to go to bed. It's getting it's already 10 p.m. on a Saturday. Why are you here? And she is still experimenting, very focused. She wants to play some video games. Well, it's not gonna happen with your husband around. So let's have you come down here and um just share the big news. I mean he already knows, but let's just remind him that we do have a baby coming soon. We're in the second trimester in two 13 hours? Really? She's only in her first trimester and she's that big? You guys, I have a feeling that we may be having some um, twins on our hands. And I definitely don't want that to happen because it's going to literally be the death of me. Because I don't know what to do with more sims like that. I don't know what to do. I don't know what it is, but I cannot stand having so many kids in my town. Like, a household. I just, I just don't get it. So Aaron's finished with his homework. That's awesome. Uh, why don't you go ahead and text Sarah a little bit. Let's give her a nice little chitty chat on the phone. She awake still? She is. Oh, cool. That's awesome. I really want them to take a few pictures together. But Lily actually ages up in a few days. Which, I actually, I feel like she should age up, like, tomorrow. Like, I feel like she's been... I'm sleeping called later. Bull oh, crap, you're sleeping. You were just talking to me, like, five seconds ago. Oh, my God. Okay, but he needs to take a shower. Why did he go into, like, his sister's... His uh, Celeste's old room to talk to her? Like, really? What are you doing? But everybody's getting a little bit tired. And I actually have to wrap up this part. Um, Let's go ahead and have him go to sleep. And then we're going to have Lily come out here and work on her logic skill a little bit. We'll use this. And she is focused, so that should help out with the skill as well. Probably raise it a little bit more. And she wants to flirt with Devin and take a vacation day. Um, too bad, because you're going to be going back to work on Monday. So you are not taking a vacation day, because you need to... Get a promotion, which you're, like, basically ready for. You're going to be at level 7 already, which is crazy. But I feel like the scientist is probably the easiest one to get the highest in. Because all you really do is just... Um, all you really do is just get your skill 
thing built up to like the breakthroughs and whatnot, and then you're basically done for the rest of it, and you don't have to do anything else. So it's pretty, pretty self-explanatory to get up. So she's gonna be doing that. He's actually sleeping in his bed, which is awesome. I want him to claim it, which is a new feature that came in in the update, which I've never actually really taken a part in yet, but which is fine. So Lily, just from using the microscope, she actually found a party in pink thing, which I have no idea what this is. Is there a wall I can put it on? I think we can put it on right here. Oh, it's really cool. That's awesome. I think I'm going to keep that just because it's cool. It's different. It's something new. And I want to keep at least one version of kind of every sample as we do this in time. Because it's pretty, pretty cool to see all the different kind of levels. And pretty sure you could probably buy them in debug mode. But uh, I really don't want to do that because you have to like search and stuff. And that's, that's just too much work right now. I can't do it. So we're not going to. Okay, so she found something else. What else did she find? She found herself a cell block. Oh, cool. What I'm going to go ahead and do is actually send her in to grab something to eat. Actually use the bathroom now that it's fixed. We're going to send her inside, get herself ready for bed. And I'm going to go ahead and actually wrap up this part. And I may play tomorrow off camera and come back on Monday when we go back to work with um, Lily to the... Um, you know, to uh, to the scientist labs, what's not thingy, my bobbers. So if you guys did enjoy this video, go ahead and leave a big thumbs up on it. And if you guys are new to my channel or you see a couple of my other videos, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below because that means the whole world to me. And I'm going to go ahead and let you guys go. And I will see you guys all in my next video. Bye, guys.